guys good afternoon hi how are you folks doing today i'm um, just doing a quick video also give me the opportunity to get used to these equipments now uh yesterday what caught my attention was that oklahoma and places like tennessee was getting some seismic activity now it's nothing to worry about too much i don't see this thing developing any bigger but uh you still want to keep an eye on it i don't want to um say like wow it's just gonna get crazy in the next few it ain't gonna happen uh it's it's it woke up a little bit but i don't think it's something you that you should worry about now this is the place that i want to i'll be worried if i was now places like oregon the northern part of california if you're in oregon washington states and vancouver and canada these location is where i would actually want to be very aware of if i live close to the shorelines all right so these are the places where you want to keep an eye. And again, yesterday, Japan went off with earthquake. The eastern part of Japan, the southern part of Japan that's close to the Philippines. I think they had like six or maybe seven earthquake. And there were like two of them. The biggest one, I think, was like 5.6 or 5.7. I think I have two of them that were over 5 point something. The long story short, as I said in my last video, because this is where you guys need to keep your eyes on, all right? japan guys keep your eyes on japan um once again folks if you're in japan watching my video you live close beside the shoreline i would be very very worried because um seeing this type of seismic activity happening there uh this often even yesterday you guys had like uh the eastern part of it also the southern part of that place i think you guys as i said like a close to six to seven of them now again guys there were two of them that was very, very close to 6.0. It weren't that far, but it wasn't a 6.0. I think, I, again, the biggest, I think, was like 5.6 or 5.7. And I think another one was like mm, 5.1. But the crazy part about these quakes, guys, none of them are below 4.0 magnitude. Every single one of them is bigger than 4.0 magnitude so once again keep an eye on japan again folks if you live north of california oregon washington states and vancouver island be very aware there's some big quakes coming your way again my friends my beautiful viewers over there in japan if you're watching my video and if you live close beside the shoreline as i've been screaming as i've been saying for days a lot of big quakes are coming coming your way and there's nothing you can do about it you just have to you know when it comes it comes but you know keep an eye on your surrounding especially again if you live beside the shorelines because you know what come with uh big earthquakes if you uh you big earthquake large body of water you know where i'm going at with this and again south america chile man chile and argentina southern uh south american continent along the shorelines chile argentina huge seismic activity huge and again folks i don't see this thing stopping i really don't i think what's going to happen is just going to gradually get in bigger and bigger and it's just going to get more frequent and i want to bring special attention to puerto rico Puerto Rico, the southern part of Puerto Rico is crazy. Um, I don't remember the name of the locate the place, but if you live on that island, the south southwest section of that island, all right. Once again, south southwest section of Puerto Rico is going to see a whole lot of earthquakes. And there's some big ones coming for that um, location. And again, guys, I'm not saying earthquake don't hit Puerto Rico. They do get earthquake. I'm not saying they don't. But what I'm saying to you is that some, there's an uptick of something, of a pattern that's unusual. It's not normal. Okay? So when something is not normal, I, I would just want to bring your attention to, to what's really going on there. So again, in Puerto Rico... The south southwest section of that island, basically the parts that's the part of Puerto Rico that's close to 
uh, Dominican Re- Dominica Republic. All right, uh, Dominica Republic. I think uh, the part of Puerto Rico. I hope I'm. I hope I'm doing it right. Um, let me let me see. Mm. I hope I'm okay. I, I right now I'm, I I just had a brain freeze. So once again, guys, let me stick to what I was saying before. I don't want to uh, go off track and, and and confuse anyone. The South Southwest. I can't for some reason. I just can't picture uh, picture the Caribbean right now in my head uh, around Puerto Rico. I don't know what's going on. So anyway, the South Southwest part of Puerto Rico. That section is just going to be seeing a swarm of earthquake, big earthquake. And it's going to be on a consistent basis for the next few days. And you guys just have to be aware of it. If you live on the that island and it's close to the shoreline, and you are close to the shoreline, and you live in that section of the island, I would be very, very aware and head on a swivel because I see some really, really big quakes coming for you folks over there. All right? So anyway, guys, again, Japan, be aware there's some quakes going on and you guys are going to be getting a lot more um quakes oregon uh washington states uh vancouver island canada chile and argentina that's the southern part part of the globe is where i would actually pay attention to and again puerto rico puerto rico south southwest section of that island is going to be getting a whole lot of earthquakes and it's going to be getting some big ones so folks again thank you guys for always watching my video thank you for sharing my video thank you for all the questions i can't answer all of them at once i'm trying my best to get to them as much as possible but i just want to say i hope you guys keep having a wonderful holiday um keep enjoying your black friday don't spend too much money now don't go too crazy and uh be safe and god bless y'all and again those places i've listed in this in this video if you live in those locations guys and you're very close to the shorelines, there's some serious seismic activity coming your way. So just be aware of it, you know, just be aware. And that's basically why I do these videos. It's not to spread any fear. It's so you can actually be aware of what's going on around the area when it comes to these seismic events and these seismic activities. So, ciao. God bless you all.